Today's question that we need to ask ourselves is why do we fast? This is our third day of fasting. Alhamdulillah, may Allah accept and make it easy. And may Allah give the greatest reward to those who are not able to fast because that's what the Prophet wasallam says that those who are not able to fast will be rewarded in full because Allah knows their situation and their condition. So the question is, why do we fast? Well, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Quran that fasting is prescribed for you as it was prescribed for the people before you. And that's because you may attain taqwa, which is piety and mindfulness of Allah. So the greatest purpose of fasting, as we see, is to attain taqwa. Taqwa is to basically protect yourself from the punishment of Allah by avoiding his prohibitions and implementing his commands. When we fast, we temporarily make haram on ourselves things that are usually halal, eating, drinking, etc. Fasting teaches us to say no to our nafs, our inner self and desires. And this in turn helps us to develop taqwa, making it easier to restrain ourselves from haram throughout the year. So fasting is therefore a means of training ourselves to obey Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, our Lord. When we become used to eating and drinking at the same time every day, our bodies start to crave food, drink when we pass that time and even before. By fasting, we wean ourselves, our nafs, off from what is accustomed from this nafs, from what this nafs is accustomed to, basically. So refusing to give in to its desires, basically. And instead of uh, following our nafs to control us, we control our nafs. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us the tawfiq. Allahumma inni as'aluka al-huda wal-tuqa wal-afafa wal-ghina. Oh Allah, I beg you for guidance, taqwa, piety, chastity, and self-sufficiency. Amin. Wassalamu alaikum.